Good night, Alice County. Tonight, I will be reading the story, The Bernstein Bears Take Off. This book was illustrated and written by Mike Bernstein. In the book tonight, we will see different types of ways that you can fly. Look, says Brother Bear, there's an air show today. Let's go, says Sister Bear. Good idea, says Papa. It'll be fun, says Mama. Plane, says Honey. Zoom, zoom. That is the first plane that ever flew, says Mama. It doesn't fly very high, says Sister, or very far, says Brother. But it does fly, says Papa. More planes were soon built, says Papa. They fly higher and faster and farther. There are so many different kinds, says Mama. That one is long and skinny, says Brother. This one has its tail in the front, says Sister. Let's go up in a balloon, says Mama. Welcome, says the guide. You can now see the show from the air. What a view, says Papa. Tell us all about the planes says Mama. These are old fighter planes, says the guide. They were early planes used in war. That one has two wings, says Brother. This one has three, Sister said. Wow, says Papa. Those planes are fast. They had to be, says the guy. They're racing planes, and the fastest plane won the race. Those planes are sort of slow, says brother. Well, not all planes need to go fast, says the guy. Some planes are like your family car. They just need to get you from here to there. Look at those planes go, says brother. That doesn't look safe, says mama. It wasn't, says the guy. These were airplanes, war planes. That's how they flew in a big fight. Those planes are loud, says sister. And big, says papa. They're giant warplanes, says the guy. They were called flying forts. They sound strong, says Mama. Roar, roar, says Honey. They were so loud they had to cover their ears. Some big planes are for travel, says the guy. This jumbo jet will take you on a trip. It can fly across the sea. It will take you to far away lands. Those planes can fly very fast, says the guy. Some have strange shapes. This one has a pointy nose, says brother. That one looks like a big boat, says sister. This is a rocket plane, says the guy. It flew faster than any plane before it. Whoosh, says honey. Not all aircraft have wings, says the guy. A blimp is lighter than air. Like our balloon, 
asked Sister. Yes, says the guy, but a blimp uses a motor to fly. So instead of flying in a basket, if you were riding a blimp, you would be riding the motor part. Helicopters can also fly without wings, says the guy. Spinning blades keep them up. They make a chopping sound, says Mama. That's why they're called choppers, says the guy. Chop, 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 says Honey. So that's the spinning part of the helicopter. And we can also call helicopters choppers. Some planes can fly without power, says the guy. They sail on the wind for miles and miles. Just like the hot air balloon, they have gliders. Some planes are very small, says the guy. You can build an ultralight yourself. Put, 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 says Honey. Some airplanes can be made from wood and other materials that are easy to build yourself. Thank you for the tour, says Papa. Look, I'm a plane, says Brother. Me too, says Sister. Now we have our own air show, says Mama. Vroom, vroom, says Honey. The end. I hope you guys enjoy that great takeoff story by the Bernstein Bears. Good night, Lowndes County.